In the summer of 2018, I got really sick and I all of a sudden couldn't eat, I couldn't sleep, I lost 12 pounds in one week and so my parents decided that they wanted to take me to the emergency room. Um, and that's when we found out that I had contracted a virus that was attacking my organs and my red blood cells. And as the hours went, my blood cell count was dropping. And at that point, doctors told me that I only had a few hours left to live, um, but that there was still one thing that they could try, but that there was no guarantee it would work, and that was a blood transfusion. And we did it, and immediately it made a difference. I was able to sit up, my heart rate started going down from the 180s. Um, at that point, I felt like I wanted to eat a little bit and, and just kind of get back to some normalcy. We were seeing some improvements, and it took some time, I spent a week in the hospital and then about three months left at home recovering before I could go back to work. Uh, but that one blood transfusion is what saved my life and is the reason that I'm still here today. So before my experience, my understanding of a blood transfusion was that it was only ever used in bad car accidents or to help gunshot uh, victims. And now in my own experience, I know that that's actually not the case and you need a blood transfusion for any, everything and anything possibly. Cancer patients get them, uh, COVID patients even need them. Um, and so donating blood is essential right now, especially for our local hospitals, because you never know until it's you when you might be the one who needs to benefit from that. To anyone thinking about donating, I say do it. You really don't know until it's you and you're up against the odds and, and it's one person, it's all it takes is one person to save your life and change your life like for me. Um, and so I know as a blood recipient, um, I'm so grateful to the people or to the person who donated for me and that's really the only reason I'm even here to talk about it today. And I know for other people who aren't as lucky, they need transfusions all the time. And so that's what keeps them going. Um, so really donations are so necessary and you can't manufacture, manufacture blood at all. So it really only comes from other people and you're helping to save a life and you're giving the gift of life too. So I know that I'll never get a chance to meet the person that did save my life, but I have to say thank you. And so I'm saying thank you to all the donors because without you, so many lives would, would be affected and so many families would lose loved ones. Um, honestly, if it wasn't for that one donation, I wouldn't be here. I wouldn't be able to help the community. I wouldn't be able to accomplish the goals I'm accomplishing. So thank you so, so much. And honestly, I, your donation touched me and I just hope that my story can touch others.